Upton TV looking at the mirror, yo, who this? Upton TV this? With the maddest and the baddest review, now miss. Need some self time, so we need it. Looking at we are, we are the realest. Bruh, for one being a representing a man for Upton TV. You understand? Yo, people, who are going big up on yourself, you know, people. You don't know, we're there again. Yeah, man, big up on yourself. We they are live up close and personal. Yes, people, Uptown TV there. So just make sure say now nah, like, share, and subscribe the thing in there. You don't know. So we are go to the Motabaruka recording tonight. You see it? And we have a reasoning where we are go kind of def, def, de, define um the word, the N-word, you know me I say. Yeah, man. And more I know if you know what hear about the topic there. So you see me? Just leave it in the comment section. Is it? We'll talk about the N-word. You understand? Yeah, man, and what people were going to bring some educational towards it. You yeah, see me, people? So, just do the right thing. Subscribe. Like up the thing. You see me? You don't know the thing, go. One love. You see it? And make sure so you like the video, because you know, we are putting in work. You understand? And it will be appreciated if you like the video. You see it? You only, it's free. You know what I mean? Just click the like button and... Me could carry on the mission. Let me know if you want to hear about the N-word conversation. You understand? We're going to differentiate it. You see it? And break it down and make you know what I'm going So, you don't know. Please, like the video. All right, my people? All right. Bless up on yourself. You don't know. Mota Baruka. Wednesday night, warm and rainy, rainy and warm. I tell you, this morning, it come like, it gone back to me as a real month, me and October. You know, we usually get rain in the month, but you know, it the climate thing a, a bad at the whole, the whole world. You know, we see place a flood whenever you used to flood. Like Abu Dhabi. <laughs> now tell you, man, sand place become rivers. Anyway, we're there with you. Don't know how much you feel the earthquake. Early on of the night, yeah. But I heard quick, they shake. I don't know what is it. They keep coming our way. About France, especially. We had a day when the football of them do great for France. You realize, say, people that ball out say, I know France win the match of Africa because most of the players them on the, foot, on the team was African. I mean, directly come from Africa, too. You know, and they live in a France. So apparently, some white guy take, you know, take it to art and a vex. And hear him say, no, him say, the black people, them, is French. So we can go and talk. Them is French. Them is French because where them go, France. But give them that so much refugee and all them people that come across and I try to enter France. Them people are not fr them people are not French. And if you go Guadeloupe, if you go Guadeloupe, you find say the pe the, the people in Guadeloupe check themselves as French. And that is the col colonial powers that France have. On his colonies, where the people them start to really accept say, them, them is fr fr French, when them is really African most of the time. We won't come feature the African music, you know, because the root of all of our intentions is embedded in the soul and the earth and all the things them that relate to Africa. It is in Africa. So when we speak of Africa, we're talking about the music, too. You know, we don't stray. Because any time we go over this, we'll come right forward to Africa. If we go over this, we'll come right forward to Africa. So, pardon me while I play some African music. I'm play music. <laughs> and we know say, most of the instruments them that the Western world use, originated in Africa, created and made by Africans. 
is one instrument we never see come across the Atlantic. One instrument. And that's a Cora, K O R A, Cora. 21 strings. And it play upright. The Cora, mostly found in Gambia and Mali. It's a very, very unique instrument. We call it a big gourd. Come like a harp. But the music is what drives it. Just like how we have the reggae. And the reggae drives and popularize Jamaica to the whole world. And them can't deny that again. Can't deny it. Taking a break and come forward. To bring forward to the people then because Ras Maka was the first out in a Bob Marley beat that stand up against the, the um, government and stand up against a developer who came into the space and wanted to bribe and to push off fishermen and just regular ones and Rastafari off of Bob Marley Beach. So, Maka um, have a special space in the movement to help decolonize Jamaican beaches as, as, as a Rastaman who cite that and say it can't go on. Yeah. And so, when I and I kind of see an article in the newspaper and um, Stephanie Marley link I with Maka, I make a trad in a Bob Marley beach and meet the brethren and, you know, him start show me so the people go him up for the space and start give I and I the history of Bob Marley beach. You know what I mean? Also known as Sugarloaf and Mountain Beach and Lion's Den. He might give me the history from such time where in the 1950s, when Rastafari faced persecution in a West Kingston, they head out to another space there. And so, Maka's um, mother, you know what I mean, Data Bubbles, was one of the ancient them who go in another space there and, you know what I mean, set it up. You know what I mean, the first Nibingi Tabernacle was built out in a, um, Bob Marley Beach. And from such time, you know what I mean, Rath Maka and the Tamat family, you know what I mean, in, also with Bongo Gabi, them hold that space there from them time there. And it was really, um, you know, an unfortunate thing when, you know, the ones they moving and wanted to remove them from the beach, you know, said them want to build a luxury hotel. And Maka said, no, it can't go on. And Maka start fight and start regularize himself in other space. You know what I mean? Him apply to adverse possession to get, you know, um, the space seal up. You know what I mean? So therefore, them can't, you know, remove them. And them still try all kind of tactics. And the Rastaman whole firm and stand up and say, no, nah, move. And so when Jabem get involved in the struggle and Mota, you come up to the protest out there and Dr. Goffman, we have to load up the entire Rastafari community and mobilize, you know, fast, fast, because eminent, you know what I mean, developer was coming in with bulldozers to rip down the space, you know what I mean? And, and so we couldn't make that go on. And the scenario is also the government that issued a land title to um, Ras Maka and then they pull back the title and say, no, they are yeah. government land the paper and, and in order for them, them, them control government land, they must be there for over 60 years. And so we have to start write some press release and make some whole nice for the government and say, even if you say 60 years, you have to occupy land pan. Rastaman out the more than 60 years. So they meet the qualification under 60 years and under 12 years as well as possession. So you cannot remove them from the space. And the government to show up and give the strength and a mark a whole the fort there to defend Bob Marley because so all of the ones that in a Jamaica now and all of the ones that in a Kingston and St. Thomas who use a beach there. I will notice that whole of people from Uptown use a the beach there. Whole of fishermen use a the beach there. The Surfing Association of Jamaica use a the beach there. They have to pay homage to that the Rasta man there. You know what I mean? Vince Maka Thomas, because him stood against the theater of oppression and steer it down and tell him that they can't take your soul. You know what I mean? So when I and I go into the space as Jabem, I learn a lot from Maka. You know what I mean? And even when the man him come in and raid him herb farm and lock up him youth, and Maka wife, sister Carmen, had to stand up and Dr. Gaff move into the space and help fight them case there. So a whole of tribulation the Thomas family faced. The whole steady Bob Marley beach 
And also, you know, Bongo Gabby family, the Stevens with them, we're still in at the Court of Appeals right now, fighting to hold Bongo Gabby space in above Mali Beach. So the tribulation still continues there because even the other day we are learned that the developers still are trying to come in again. You know what I mean? So Bob Marley Beach have to be grateful. We have to be grateful all across the Jamaican island that Maka could stand firm and defend the thing. Yeah. And when Maka defend the thing don't know, Maka decides that yeah, me to make a, a repatriation in Africa. You know what I mean? They fight a battle, them win the battle, them win the land out there, and them settled. And what Rastafari did, Rastafari turned on and said, you know something, I'm going to donate a piece of this to Naya Bingi Ada and to all Rastafari to rebuild the tabernacle in a Bob Marley Beach. So I space out of Bob Marley Beach right now to rebuild that original tabernacle. You know what I mean? And that show you the goodness of the brethren art. And he make him try in Africa. He go to Ghana and make him way all the way down um, Central America into Brazil and fly, fly in Ghana and make him journey inside here. And it's just an unfortunate thing that the brethren, you know, pass shortly after him, um, him reaching Ghana and transition in Ghana. But him doing work, motor. What them say kill him? What them say kill him? What them say kill him? But which the, the whole thing is not fully known, but no, it got sick there. Oh. Um, you know, I may have picked up a, you know, a nasty bug of, or, of something and, you know, the emergency services, you know, probably never make it there um, in time. You yeah. know, so, um, in, 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 in transition, and them, and them thing there, which is, you know, for another time for reason about that, but the bridging did him work, yeah. did him work a yard, and it make him way back to the motherland. And so, you know, with that said, you know, the family want to you know make it into Ghana, you know what I mean, to really um you know send them off to the yeah. ancestors. And and so you don't know if you make them try that in Africa a whole heap of money because unfortunately there's no direct flight between Jamaica and yeah, the motherland. Yeah, come to America, Panama, England. Yeah, you know what I mean? So the family wanna make a trad. And we are we are trying to help the family now with a fundraiser, you know, you know, down on the beach on May eleventh. So this one send out the sounds across Jamaica and across the world because we'll give our account number to where anyone where they anywhere in the world and want to make a donation towards the family to really uh, make that trip there, you know what I mean? Um into Ghana. So if if the ones them can make it and we are ask the one if they try to make it May eleventh down on the beach. Big celebration and go go on down on the beach there. You know what I mean? The thing are open up around noon. You know what I mean? What if an artist, you know what I mean? Jamil and, you know, Nature Ellis and... We they have the account the number. Call the account number. Yes, the account number right now is um is with JMMB Bank branch in a New Kingston. Um, so it's zero, zero, zero. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, give me no, go on. Go on up. Zero, yeah, zero, 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 three, zero, zero, one, nine, zero, four, six, six. Okay, I see a JMB, JMB Bank. Yes, JMBB Bank, um, JM, yeah. JMMB Bank in a New Kingston um, um, branch. Okay. So, yeah, any donation, the ones them have, you know what I mean, that would be very, very um, welcome by the family because it's like, it's like almost, you know, 1,700 US dollar for your ticket. It's 1,656 US dollar for your ticket to make that track there in, a, in a Ghana. And, you know, we are trying, see if we can really raise enough money for it. At least, you know, five of the family members, them, you know what I mean? Sister Carmen have to make a trip there, you know what I mean? So we are just ask the, the, the public out there, you know what I mean, if them can really come in and, and support, you know, because it's generous, you know. I mean, you know, you buy a ticket, um, for, um, for, you're, you're going free, you make a donation, you make a donation for 2500 and you're going to get some ital food and sit. 
You know what I mean? So, um, you know, that, that, that's a reasonable dream. You don't know, no session at Jamaica where I give you that. And it's for a worthy cause. It's for a worthy cause because when we see who are going in a Jamaica with all of the beaches, them, we are our own government in collusion with private, um, um, you know, um, individuals have displaced many of us. And when we can see, we can stand up and a, and a, and a one can stand and face down government and face down, um, you know, in a private investor and protect our space for the Jamaican people. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? We know that them fight, they take certain level of commitment, you know what I mean? Certain levels of just losing the fear and bravery. Yeah. Stand up against them system of oppression, yeah. And Maka did that, you know what I mean? So we'll forever, you know what I mean, remember that bridge, you know? mm-hmm. And we just want the family to really make the trade in Ghana yeah. and, and really um, send them off. So, so the time is, 11th, is, uh, is Saturday the 11th. Yes. Saturday, May the 11th, right? Yes. Yeah, and out of Bamal Beach. When it start, you say, come in about what time people should have started coming, 12? So, yeah, coming 12, you know, what if activity is going to be, yeah. short time is like, you know what I mean, short time at 6, 6 p.m. in the evening, you know what I mean, right. but you don't know, I mean, what if activity is drumming and go out there, you know what I mean, as I say, Bunga Herman is going to in the space, you know what I mean, we have um, Fred Lack out there, and we have all of other artists, you know, yeah. you know, I mean, Kidos I, you know, I mean, Rockstop and, you know, I mean, Jamil and, you know, Nature Ellis and all them one day, I go in at the space and just come really meet the family, come meet an original Naya Bingi family who, you know, live, live a, a life of Rastafari and protect the space, you know what I mean? So we know that Bob Marley Beach is, you know, the case is still in the court. We're going back in the court on the 24th of May. Because we need to really protect the track that leads us down to the beach. That and that man say, you know, the other day, my driver looked for the, the, the entrance and couldn't find it. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, you see what them do out there? So they build the road and yeah, they I. no provision. Yeah, 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 they build it high. So which part, tell the people which part they must enter from. So, I mean, all right, you see. Because they lick down all the police station and they always use to make a, uh, 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 use to give the people a spot. So right now, because they must be kind of, you see, it's tough in a motor. You know what we are going to do for the people? Eh? Yeah. We are going to erect a sign. We are going to erect a sign. I uh, put up some red wood and green flag by the, the road. This edge, yes, man. yes. Yes, that's what we're going to do. We're going to yeah. put some red, green, and gold flag up there. Yeah. So you can't miss it when you're coming in. Pan, yeah, pan, yeah I'm going miss it, man. I'm telling you, I'm going miss it bad. Because I'm going to say, we're on the road, so I and the ground wrong. So. <laughs> we're going to say, the ground, the queer, the queer, so I'm going to drive up there. So it looks like we pass it. And a man said, no, Virgin, I'm going to use that, that entrance there again, you know? Right. Mm. You know, and you see, you have to get on the other side and kind of make a turn around and come in. Because yeah. the man them know have a big border in the middle. And you see, it, it, this is the way our government treat us. I mean, big Bob Marley Beach. You know what I mean? Iconic space. Big celebration, you know I mean? You know, around one love film and everything Bob Marley. And the road that leads you to Bob Marley Beach, the government could not make a proper road down there for the community. No, because them don't want to go down there. That's why they don't make a road. You know, I don't know why it is the hypocrisy of our government that treat us this way. And so, you know, we we'll fight to keep the space and then still have put all kind of obstacles and barriers in our yeah, way. Yeah, and we're yeah. not going to stop until we get the space fully. We need it to be written and yeah. any land titles down there that that space belongs to the public and that we are fight for. All right, we have to go move, we have to go move. move. We have to move. Yeah, man. All right, Maybe give chance, yeah. Formality. Yeah, yeah, man. man. All right. Far. We keep reminding them. Rem- remind them. Yeah, yeah that man. was Devon Taylor, as usual. It's a big problem right across the island. Right across the island. They are getting us claustrophobic in, the, in our own space. You know, 
land lock us in our own space, land of wood and water. No, we do have no water, as a matter of fact. We see a whole heap of wood. All over the place we see a whole heap of wood. But water is a problem. Okay, here we go, here we go. <laughs> the rage just stopped fall, but it was a sweet gathering, man. Why are you look know, urban me like, you know? And why are you look know, the lot from, from Night Market, Babsy Grange. Yes, it was a wonderful ambience, wonderful setting. It reminds me, anybody remember when Sunsplash did keep in a Ronnie Williams Center there? Eh? I bet you only never know what's a Sunsplash. So it's like keep in a random William Center one time, you know. And guess who did the Peter Tash. Peter Tash. Them these days, they, they style them about for $25. Rental style of metal, sinking to a juice and all them here. Oh gosh, man. Yeah, right in a random William there. Sun splash. Well, last night was like a sun splash. Believe you me, last night was like a sun splash. It was sweet, man. The jazz are pump and everything. No at editness inside it, so yes, okay. So here we are now. We are gonna take a break and come forward. Cause you know, so we reach halfway the program and so now. Halfway. So we're gonna take a break. No, we can go and play this music here and find it. Yes. Here we go. What's good? All right, all right. What if I told you? that the way that you use language every day had the power to either uphold or disrupt social injustices? What if I told you that because language is saturated with history and culture and memory, the way that it is policed within our classrooms and our communities is deeply connected to racism and colonialism. You see, when I was 19 years old, I sat on a panel for a room full of high school students. And a woman in the room stopped me in the middle of speaking and she said, I, I'm sorry to stop you, but I just want you to know that, that you are so articulate. And in that moment, she meant it as a compliment. A friend of mine next to me was like, boo. And I was offended. And most people can understand that. Most people say, well, you were offended because you're a young black woman in this space and this woman found it exceptional that you were mastering standard English. But there's another reason why I was offended. I imagined if this woman heard me speaking with my family who's Trinidadian and Caribbean creolized English would she have determined something else about my intellectual capacity? Or if she heard me speaking with my friends in Crown Heights, Brooklyn, in African-American English, would she have determined something different about my worth? And in that moment, I understood that the answer was yes. And that deeply disturbed me. It actually became the impetus for my first TED Talk, Three Ways to Speak English. It actually became the impetus for my research as a social scientist, analyzing the intersections of language, race, and power. You see, I'll share this story, and you gotta work with me, because it's about a man and a lion, and they're talking, all right, work with me. So the man and the lion are walking through the jungle together, and, and, and they're arguing about who's the strongest. And the lion says, I'm the king of the jungle. I'm stronger than you. And the man says, I'm the king of the world. I'm stronger than you. And they're having this fruitless argument until they stumble upon a picture. Still in the jungle. Keep working with me, right? And the picture is of a man defeating a lion. And the man says, you see, I told you I'm stronger than you. And the lion says, yes, but who drew that picture? What has become important to my work in working with historically marginalized communities at the intersections of language, race, and power in education is interrogating 
who authors the dominant narratives and the dominant framings in our societies, in our schools, in our, in our classrooms, in our world. It's important to know that in exploring and doing this research on language, race, and power, I stumbled upon some really interesting contradictions. You see, what I know of myself is that the multiple literacies that I bring to the table, my composite linguistic identity gives me power. But when I enter into institutional spaces, into classroom spaces, that power is not valued and often stripped away. In these spaces that claim to celebrate diversity, that claim to want to celebrate diverse culture, what instead happens is a perpetual invitation to engage in cultural erasure. But I found some contradictions in exploring these questions both contextually and historically, right? So in the social context of now, one of the contradictions I found was with the McDonald's slogan. Who knows the McDonald's slogan? I'm loving it, right? I'm loving it. We know that. What I found in my research is that this slogan is participating in a feature of African-American English called consonant variation. The dropping of the letter G. This very statement, I'm loving it. This very feature, this consonant variation is something that would be corrected within a classroom space if I were to write it on my paper. Yet this billion dollar corporation is able to utilize this linguistic practice for mass appeal and to capitalize on this cultural form of expression. I found another example in the show Modern Family. You know, I, I love that show. And there's this episode called She Crazy which is weird because like, there's not a lot of people of color in the show, right? And so I'm looking at the episode and throughout the episode, everyone, she crazy, she crazy, she crazy. And I'm like, okay, I do my research. Brilliant scholars have shown us that another feature of African-American English exists there called copula absence, the absence of the verb to be. These features that have been asserted and designated and researched by linguists for years have been established as features of African-American English that directly connect to the West African languages that they are historically rooted in. These language practices are valued in particular spaces, but there's a contradiction with what happens in institutional spaces, right? And there's a history here. I travel up this issue because it is resonant with a history that is deeply rooted in racism and colonialism. There's a West African author, his name is um, Gugi Wationgo. I speak of him often. He wrote this book called Decolonizing the Mind. He speaks about his time existing in colonial Kenya. He was there before Kenya was colonized. He said there was a time when the language of the classroom and the language of the community were one, but then came a colonial education. He said Berlin of 1884 was affected through the sword and the bullet. Right? But the, the, the night of the sword and the bullet was followed by the morning of the chalk and the blackboard. He said the bullet was the means of physical subjugation. Language was the means of spiritual subjugation. What would happen is, if you were caught speaking your mother tongue, Bikuyu, in the classroom, in colonial Kenya, you would either be physically beaten or you would have to wear a sign around your neck that said, I am stupid or I am a donkey. It was very important to the colonial subjugation process that the language of the people who were being oppressed was divorced from the community. Those are some of the practices that we reiterate today. When I talk about liberation literacies, the work that I do with educators across our country, it's because that historical and, and, and contextual dissonance that I'm bringing up plays out right now in our world. I work with members of historically marginalized communities. Young black people who say, yes, I engage in black li literacy practices but in places where I feel safe. 
A sense of fugitivity exists there that has historical resonance in American chattel slavery. A time when it was illegal for black people in this country to be able to read and write. A lot of that resonates with what's happening today in our classroom and in our world. There are so many ways to engage in racism. There are so many ways to engage in oppression. There are wonderful scholars who say language is a site of cultural struggle. Right? And if we think about that, if we think about what it means in our institutional spaces to continue participating in the erasure and the oppression of people from historically marginalized groups instead of incorporating, validating, and celebrating who they are in these institutional spaces, then we do a disservice to ourselves and to our world. So a lot of times when I bring up this conversation, that question of uh, standard English as the language of power comes about which is why I brought up the McDonald's example, which is why I brought up the spaces where this power exists. There's a wonderful book called Articulate While Black that speaks about President Obama's ability to navigate multiple languages and literacies and his that centrality, the centrality of that was essential to the success of his campaign. You see, a lot of times you hear the word minority to refer to people who look like me. But I'm a member of the global majority. And it means that the languages, the literacies, and the power that comes from the marginalized spaces that people of color navigate have wonderful tools and power to transform our world, to give us access. So when I talk about liberation literacies, really what I'm talking about is a set of principles that emerge out of the work that I do, the research that I've done, and the practice that I engage in. And actually a lot of what you saw today is framed by these principles that I'm gonna share with you in a moment. The idea that the voices of these young people cannot be constrained and limited to that typical five paragraph essay. The power of what they have to say is so much deeper than that. And to silence them and to continue marginalizing the identities of students in the service of a singular standard, is violence. So there are five principles, and I call these paradigm principles. I call them paradigm principles because often when I share these principles, um, educators, administrators, people who work in, in, in educational contexts, it just sounds like more work to do. Like, oh, you're giving us more work to do. We got enough to do, right? But these are paradigm principles. And I say they're paradigm principles because they are principles that are centered on and governed by a paradigm shift. Stephen Covey says that paradigms are maps. Low key, I want Stephen Covey to be my white uncle. Like, really, like, I love this guy, right? So he said, like, paradigms are maps. It's the way that we approximate reality. And so what I'm saying is that Once we reconstruct and understand that institutional spaces must reimagine themselves to truly understand, integrate, and accept the diversity that exists in our world, we need new paradigms in order to enact that. Actually, right now, many of the predominantly white institutions that exist in our world still have the infrastructure from slavery. The time on IREFM is from slavery. There are historical colleges right now that still have the slave quarters built in. If we don't reimagine our institutional spaces beyond just the inclusion of having someone of a different race in the space, then we are not truly integrating anything. Right. So so the first pap, there are five principles and the, and the five principles, there are five A's. They're all A's because I'm a poet and I like rhythm. I like, you know, I like alliteration. It's just who I am. Right. So there are five A's and the first A speaks to awareness. The first A says, who am I? If we are thinking about nurturing youth voice, 
creating space for youth voice in our classrooms in new and in powerful ways that disrupt the historical, racist, colonial perceptions that we've upheld for too long. It has to begin with critical awareness. Who am I as a student? Who am I as an educator in the space? And what does that mean in our world? And it's not just a random awareness, but an awareness of the social identities that we each navigate, including the language practices that we bring to the table. So that I get to say, well, actually, I speak African-American English. I speak Caribbean Creolized English. There are multiple ways that I understand and articulate and name the world around me. Right? The first A is that awareness. Thinking about who you are and what your linguistic repertoire consists of. The second A speaks to agency and access. You see, once you understand who you are, once you understand the privileges that are associated with different aspects of who you are or the way that who you are is marginalized in different ways, once you get a full understanding of what that means in our communities, a lot of young people, I, I work with a lot of young um, people who engage in African-American English practices but have no idea that it has value because they've been taught that it's wrong, that it's bad, that it's delinquent, that it's deficient. Once you go through that awareness process and you become aware that my language has power, right? Once you become aware of that, then you say, well, what kind of agency and access exists for me in the world? Because of the way that I speak, because of the tools that I bring to the table with my linguistic repertoire, there are spaces that I can access in the world. There's agency that I can have. That was the argument for, for, for Barack Obama's ability to access and bond with different communities because he could speak in different ways. The third A speaks to actualization. This principle, this paradigm principle says, if we do not create continuous opportunities to actualize different ways of knowing and being and expressing in institutional spaces, then we're not doing this work. And that goes directly to the term liberation, right? So the term liberation, when I say liberation literacies, the term liberation in this framework is actually rooted in liberation theology. Liberation theology argues for the interpretation of scripture from the perspective of the oppressed. Understanding that the central figure of scripture was actually someone who was poor and marginalized. And it reimagines the way that we can interpret the world if we understand the power that happens in the margins. And so that liberation piece speaks to the disruption that happens in actualization. Having a TED talk at the center of your English curriculum is disruptive. This disrupts the traditional notions of what it means to read and write in our world, right? What it means to inscribe yourself into the narrative of history beyond the five paragraph essay is that I'm going to go up and I'm going to speak from the power of my voice. That's actualization. That's disruptive and that's powerful. The fourth A speaks to achievement. Because a lot of times when, when I do this work, there are folks who are like, well, you, you know, you, you just want the, you want the kids to be lazy. Actually, it takes a lot more work to be fully invested in who you are, what you have to say, than to perform school for somebody who is imposing a structure on you. Achievement means that we have rigorous, powerful standards, not just for our students, but for our classrooms and our institutions. How are our institutions and our classrooms achieving the aims of true diversity and equity? When we think about achievement, we often think about assessing the students and we never think about assessing the institutions that are meant to serve the students. So achievement is not unidirectional. It says we want to understand how engaging in this process transforms the student, but how engaging in this process transforms the space and transforms the discipline. I work with young people in New York City, and we teach them the qualitative research process. They do research, powerful research on their schools and community, but they learn it alongside hip hop literacies. So when they're sharing with you their research data and analysis process, 
Sometimes they spit in bars. It changes the way that we imagine engaging in the exchanging of content. It actually transforms it. When we engage in, 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 in hip hop cultural practices around freestyle, extemporaneous practices, different cognitive abilities come to the fore. There's value in those practices that challenge the discipline. So achievement speaks to that. Achievement speaks to challenging the standards that we hold for ourselves and our institutions and our world. And then the last A speaks to alteration and action. It means that this is a principle that says that we are invested in understanding that our institutions must be adaptable, must be accommodating and truly inclusive of diverse ways of knowing. So once we understand the way that a different form of literacy that the linguistic repertoire, the histories, the cultures, the memories of the young people that we work with, once we un understand the way that that challenges this institution, we think about how we reimagine the institutional space. My curriculum can't stay the same. My pedagogical approaches cannot stay the same. This institution might need to reimagine itself. Back to the hip hop example, in hip hop, the cipher that we participate in is a circle. There is no one person standing at the front bearing all knowledge and imposing it on the room. It's a democratic space. So when I teach in my classrooms as a professor, we gotta sit in a circle. We gotta challenge the idea of what teaching and learning looks like because I'm learning from this cultural space that there are different ways of imagining our world. I say to you this story of my father who taught me how to ride a bike when I was 10 years old in, in Brooklyn. And I had a little pink bike and he, uh, you know, he's just like, all right, jump on it, go for it. I got on the bike and I fell, right? Because I, I didn't know how to ride a bike. So over and over again, he tried to get me, he tried to hold me, it didn't work out. So he said, he said, get off the bike. He has a thick, trendy accent, so he didn't say, like, get off the bike, right, right? He has, like, a whole accent. So he's like, get off the bike. I get off the bike, and he's like, do you have balance? I'm like, I don't know. Like, you know, I'm 10. I don't know. He's like, do you have balance? He said, so I want you to stand on one foot. I stood on one foot. He said, a couple of minutes, I'm like, yo, this guy's tripping. Like, I don't know what's going on with daddy today, but okay, I'm just on this side. We're standing on one foot. After a couple of minutes, I found my balance. He said, now get back on the bike. I got back on the bike and I rode straight down the block. What my father taught me in that moment was that if I did not have balance in myself, it would be impossible for me to have balance on the bike. I introduced this framework, this notion of liberation literacies and a call to action for a paradigm shift that begins with a critical awareness of yourself and your world. Because if we do not have socially just practices in ourselves, here, in the silence, then it is impossible to have social justice in our world. Thank you. Okay, all right, so I'm going to go and do that. I play that Afrobeat. But other music, the 50 different countries in Africa that produce music, indigenous music, tribal music, nation music, all sorts of different music can be enjoyed. Africa we are, yes. We, we decide for ourselves. Okay, here. Yeah, blessed. Yeah, yeah, blessed man. Yeah, no. Because music is music, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, anywhere in the world, yeah, music is just music. Yeah, man. When Muta, I want to big up first, I want to big up um, the, the, the lady we are running. 
Chomi Kafa Justice and you know, Michelle Michelle Jackson. Okay. Yeah, me like how she, you know, how she are running. Yeah, how she active, yeah, and I deal with it. No partisan thing she are going, you know? Yeah. Just human rights thing she are dealing with. Yeah, man. When you see people, them weird, you know, you have to really give them them respect, you know? Yeah. You know? But the, the, the thing I'm here to talk about, you know, are the DPP. The DPP, she's still in active. No, man, I'm going to tell you, so she has to the same day, man. Okay. Because all me see it is like she'd have run a couple, she'd have run um, about a year illegal. Yeah, well, well, well. I, 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 that the PNP said, so them, them come, the court said, yes, them have to let her go. But it's it, 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 so, it look a way, you know, when people just want to hold on and, you know. You know, that's why I want constitutional um, reform and set up yeah. this constitution yeah. of Jamaica, you kind know, of, because... Then you get to the Republic, now. Nah, I'm not getting there next year. Now nah, I'm not getting next year. Well, you we know, so we the people that can't deal with it, you know. Mm -hmm. To be frank, you know. No. Because you can't have six people investigate. They might investigate six people, six people in a parliament for you, which enrich themselves off of taxpayers' money and all them things there. And expect them to, to make law and create law, legislate law, seen for people, especially constitution where you don't know, say, the constitution, a 10, a ten chapter, you know. So who are going to do it? Who are going to do it? Well... If them can't do it, who are going to do it? Well, well you're going to see it now, you know. You're going to see it now. Them... them Something new has to go come to deal with it. You know? Like what, sir? Like what? It's a new government. A new okay. government has to go deal with it more, sir. See, because... How me look upon it, you know? The government has too much thing to hide, you know? Yeah, well, the people have two choices right now. It's either PNP or GLP. Ah, so, that's what I'm so, saying. So, yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. I'm sorry to have to go, go. So, yeah, it's a PNP then. Yeah, and them have got to deal with it if them win or if either one a reform or get out the the, the eight six and, 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 and the six and reform them themselves on a level because them them want to do it from top to bottom, you know. So, you know. It's like it 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 it's their way, you know. Jamaica you know, it 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 it, it, it messed up man. So why if you say other one them now see the same way? No, well, the reason why I said that, you know, is like maybe the other one, they might go fresh. So them can yeah. deal with, we have to deal with until because if them come, you know, if them come and I deal them with, you know, we there after them, you know, as, as Pan African, you know. No, we're going to say, we're going to talk about the Republic, something. Yeah. And them, they look about the Republic, you yeah, say, this government can't deal with Republic business. And you have no PNP. You have seen the PNP have a deal with it, have to deal with it. But all you know is PNP. All right, let's show you what I'm doing. All right, let me show you what I'm going with that government. You know. I told you now that government is um, put in a constitutional um, ministry. You know. And don't pass nothing, and don't legislate nothing. We are not going to pass. We are not going to pass. We are going to pass. Republic, I will pass to where they might yeah. go and where they might go. You just say the PNP have a deal with it. So I say, oh, you know, say the PNP have a different from the GLP to deal with it. The Republic. Because they might claim now, say it can't do next year again. So you are saying, yeah. oh, them to come out of power and get the PNP. So I say, oh, you know, say the PNP now have do something the same way. No, we can't if. We can't, if you know, we have to just say, them are going to do it. Because uh, uh, between the two of them, see if you get the level, I say. No, we don't have a problem if I don't say two of them we have to work with. We yeah, but, but we have a problem, we have a big problem. But it has to deal with really, because this thing, thing now work. Mm -hmm. See if I understand what I say. So, me I say, this government more over like a PR. See, them just PR because even look at, look at even the centrals. This government coming like that, my sense of them can't complete, you know. 
see because you don't know where Pan African we talk it like how we see seeing human rights activity. Seeing a centrist, something like a centrist in our country. I take up so long and I'll know them can't complete a centrist. To take up a centrist. See? Look on the constitutional um them 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 have a constitutional ministry you know, where them are use money and them are spend money, how much money, taxpayers' money, all them things there. And about two years now, they have that ministry there. And them can legislate a law, them can and uh, uh, not, not done. See? The republic thing, it, 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 the far to. See? So, that's what I mean, I say. And when you look on it, when you look on how oh, 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 it's set up now, you hear, say, six people are investigate. See? In the government, in the cabinet. See? Now, if you have six, just put it away then. If say, say you have six criminals, you can't have six criminals and make law, and a create law, see, and a legislate law, see, laws like constitutional law, that constitutional law, you know, govern our law, you know. See? Ten chapter that, you know. Yeah, you understand what I'm saying? See? So, it, 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 it complicated. Yeah, we are say, but we still depend it. But no, you can't depend. The reason why I'm saying no, the two are too evil, but at the same time, seeing that evil are not create nothing, not go on under this. Seeing till you are here now, say it's not go up until 2025 and the time and this, that, very. If to a, to, to a thousand miles, you, know, you, you, you have to make a step. You know. See? So the journey could have long to a thousand miles. You have to start a step. See? And no step now start. See? It's more like a PR, PR thing. Go on, you know? Like people just a PR to see what can go on with like winning election and all them because foolishness there. And Jamaica people, we are dealing with, we are dealing with Jamaica. See if you understand me, I say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See it? So, when I look on it now, I just look on it where I say, I saw it go. I don't know if you see that view there, you know, but I have a view that means it. Because I can have a different view. You know. you so, see? you have seen how say, Next election, the people they must vote for the government. That's what I said. Yeah, well, you see, me na me no go around curve and me not talk. Me no me no me no know that them. Me no PMP na GLP. Me a human rights activist, right? Yeah, hear me. Seen a Pan African, seen a human rights activist, work with Amnesty International. Me, I say. Right now, if you have a government with six people where they find investigation and them little thing there, you have to go deal with a new government. See, because this is law, you know, we don't want to make that, that, that mistake like Bustamante, like when Bustamante got in England and them, them white people there, seeing each up a thing, each up a thing and give them, and them come down with it. And the only thing where it benefit is them, see? But when them all when them all do something, them can't go to prison, them can't go to jail because it's a loop it's a loophole. And that happened to the constitution, you know, you know. See? That's why you have all people at thief all 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 education money. They use them money, they look at you them education money which for them not turn criminal. See? Or for them not grow up as a criminal. See them go good school and go and, and the school where you help them. You have money to thief them money and still through the law of loophole, big liar can send out England and Ray Ray and go on, go on till all five, six years. Not, you know, hear about it and everything wash out. See, we want this constitution we are going now. See, we need the people, people's constitution. We want to set things where we should say a rural politician, them are rural. We, we, you understand? Them are serve we. See? They understand that we are going to pay them. Our tax money, money, taxpayers' money pay them. So they are work with we and we set laws where govern them, seeing like two-term 
between everything oh, we, can, we can't do that to the government. Yeah. We have to do it with PNP. We can't do it to the government. Yeah. No, Mota. The government is yeah. tainted. And the other one not tainted. The other one, maybe a different leader. I don't know. Maybe them come something different. Mm. See, I said, going on. You have to just put it like our setting. You, know. you have a new man of a work for you. The, the old man seen him. Who, him, who him, knew? Who knew? Him, who you him, him up the house. No, who you said new? New no, man. No, by leader. I live leaders. Leaders. A long time, leader, man, like, a long time, man, go in and work a, a politician, you know. Yeah, but my goal never be prime minister yet, Mota. Yeah, but that no means a truth. So what? Yeah, but, that but means, prime minister have a whole power. power, man. Prime minister have no power and no power. Prime minister have no just listen to me, I said, man. And, and, so, and, some clean people, people, yeah, and watch me now with some clean people and some clean other people. So, which one like are them that PLP cleaner than which one? With some them? younger youth, some younger youth, and everything, and some younger man will never no, no TNT yet. And that may I talk about, you know. Which one are them? Oh, you know, PLP, now I'm a TNT person at them, at them party. Yeah, but bless it. Watch me now. You hear me, I man. Like I hear what you say, man. See? Then I said PMP have the TNT yeah. people in our in our world. But them less TNT than that you say. But them less TNT is a smaller evil. See? Yeah. You get the level me I say. See? Mm, and so keep when you look at it now, we are going now. You look at the president, you know. A man... No, I don't look at the president. I look at the PNP there from 19... Oh, oh, oh. PNP there and JLP there from a long time. And do, the two of them are going to see me here from how much years. So, Why you feel so that means that you're going to change. So, Mota, so yeah. that means that you're not going to have to start to repeat. No, that means, want, say, that means that you're going to the two of them and find something else. Yeah, but we are going to find what they, what they, you are just too uh, evil. You have to, you have to, you have to, you have to, you have to choose off us. No, no Bridget, look at, look at. All right, go and talk and talk. Yeah, we, we all choose off us. You know, you have to choose off us. So you have to choose, you have to choose after the smallest, you have to have whosoever so what to do it. So what happened to the people them? Why do they have to do it now? No, wait, this. what happened to the people them voice to communicate what them want? They were mutual. No, me and your voice out all the way. No, we have voice out, man, about constitution. And the PNP, the PNP, I'm going to listen to it more than the PNP. The PNP, I want the constitution change. So the PNP, Nothing on the constitution change. So the PNP want to change? No, you think them politicians, yeah. Are we are pressured. We're not about PNP politicians, like the JNP politicians. Are we are pressured. But, but you want to PNP or JNP? You have said PNP or JNP. Yeah, but no, 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 the two of them, you know, if you have a parliament for that, for that, for that I don't one. say, look, I don't say you have to have a parliament, you know. Yeah. I'm saying to you, they have a parliament for much years now. And I don't see the trajectory of the country move. That's so we motor. need a new party or a new yeah, group of where the, people. Where the party there? The, the, something the party. Him come and him, him, them, them jail him one time. See? And him, and him run down high. What name? Come on, remember him name. You know? See? Who? And Patterson. 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 Yeah. Patterson, yeah, talk about. See? And him run down high. And him don't know say struggle or something where you have to just put, you have to put your life on the line. See? You have to move like Marcus, you have a Malcolm X. Then the man that raised him, then they would go march on someone. Yeah. And a little one march, they would march, them, them, them arrest him, and him no know, say, if him get more arrests, and more, and more, and more people, and more power, and more get. Like Donald See? Trump. Like Donald Trump, yeah. <laughs> See? So, him no know them things there, so him, but when you, when you, when you break it down now, it's only two evil we have to choose off of. See? One of the evil we are going on now. Tainted. See? And, and, and it, it kind of stay away with them, you know, because oh, oh, you feel, you, 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 you feel have a ministry, see? Where you create now. You create a ministry, a constitutional ministry. See? And you have that. I go, I go for two years now. You can't, nothing legislate. Nothing reform. You can't reform some laws. See, say no reach republic yet, yet then. You can't take time and reform some law. You don't reach no way. You don't go uh, couple tonal meat and just say you eat tonal meat and and all and nowhere. See it now go. And then when you look on it now, 
it look a way because if six people are an investigation, and you are that, and guess what, that, and you are that, 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 that. So let me ask you a question. Is not the PNP and the GLP come together to deal with the Republic something? It's just the GLP are deal with it. The PNP don't have no information. No, have no intake in it. No, they never have been taken out. But no, 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 we, no, no, we're not going to them up. You don't know how oh, 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 you know, no, no, Parliament no, run, man, no, Mota, man. Wait, no, I'm not going to them up. Shall the government run power? Listen to me, Mota, man. Listen yeah. to me, Mota, man. You have said them up, go. What I'm to know is not not them up, go. What I'm to two parts of them at Sidon, which them are do, and I try to rectify the Republic thing. The Mota. And the two of them are doing it, you know. I'll be able to lead half a lead, you know, from... No, from no, start. it's where it's where the two of them come together and no, deal with... No, Buta, would listen to man. Me, no. See, you know that. If, no, if, if no, I think no, no, start, no, no. At the GLP, at the leader right now, you know. Look at... At the Prime Minister, you know. The PNP are government, you know. The PNP ministry. The PNP is part of the government, you know. Buta, the PNP can only come after the government do something. The PNP is part of the government... Mota, just listen to me. So no, 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 man. I listen to what you have to listen they, to me. They can not go come in after a man say, all right, see a man say, Mota, listen to what me has to do. No, no, right? you're you going to listen to what I say now. Yeah, yeah, I listen to yeah, you now. All right, listen to me now. The PNP and the GLP is the government of Jamaica. The two of them sit down in a parliament and decide, make decisions. So, them have one majority and one minority. But in certain things, for instance, on the Republic thing, the two of them have to come together and figure out what the people them want and what the people them don't want. No one party can decide what the people them want in our republic where them have town hall meet, where them have meet together, where we don't know about what them have. And them sit down and rectify the thing. Just like how Buster and, and Manly they sit down and give it the, 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 um, the constitution. The PNP and the GLP is the government. They're going to sit down and decide which constitution they will give it. All the government have a run. It's just yeah, like but, a, but who, who have a lead? A liar, the man so the me parliament, me. the government cannot come now. The, this lead, leading government, you know, cannot come and say, all right, we want, um, we have name there. We want Bob Zikurians to be the president. And, look, and all of the man them in the GLP say, yeah, we want Bob Zikurians. It don't work that way. No, that's why they have a constitutional Then the two parties, they have decided it. Because the two parties, they have decided it. That's why they have reached nowhere at all now. No, but the two parties, they have decided it. And the two parties, one can't say, all right, I want Pusha to, I want um, only to be president of the Republic, and then everybody say, because them say, they want president of the Republic, everybody will say, yeah, we want president of the Republic. All right, you know, I like the two of them have to come to that conclusion. Say yes, like give it. me the proof. I like to talk to a constitutional lawyer. Seen from the program one of them nights. Uh. Seen because, you see, uh, you see all the way I go on with the republic and the constitution, you know. If you notice, you know, the government set up a constitutional No, I mean, no, see, of course you know. the government uh, never set it up. Seen, but yeah, yeah but, but, that. That. but the seen. government cannot come and say, we want oldness to be the president, and you can't do nothing no, about no, it. No, no, individually, no, they've got that difference. Because we have we 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 take part in the Constitution, too, you know. But a Republican can't have me, what you Me and some suggestions and some laws, you know, where, where, where yeah. me and some people talk about and see now. Yeah, then suppose the jury position agree with you and the JLP not agree with you. Eh? Suppose the PNP agree with you and the JLP not agree with you. No, man, no PNP we are dealing. We are dealing with the people and we have set up the, 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 no. the, the, the law. The, the law, the law. But it's the same people that have set up the law. It's the same people that have set up the law. It's the same people that have set up the law. Yeah, but Mota, we are, we are, we are putting our thing to, you know. No, so, man, we are putting our thing to, you know. know. Me have to, but right now, the people who are dealing with the Constitution. Who will accept your thing? Who will accept your thing? Who will accept your thing? Who accept eh? your thing? No, you don't know. You don't know if they're going to accept it. Or if no, no, no. All right. That's why we don't really talk about something and it's not happening yet, you know. No, That's really. If, if them we say... Me all right. push my thing and if it happens, it happens. All right, if so if them say it happens... And if they have to revolute, revolute. If them say it happens, who will decide to say it happens? 
Now who for decide? Who? Who? Who are you dealing with it? Who are dealing with it? The constitutional. The, the, the PNP or the JLP, which one no, are they? No, no, it's PNP. Uh, no, PNP. You say no, 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 they're there. You say no, they're there. You know, they're not the government. They're not the government. They're not the government. But I'm going to tell you, but I'm going to tell you, they're not the government. PNP and JLP are the government. Yeah, but I'm going to tell you, they're not the government. 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 The two parts of them must come together and come to a conclusion about what is what and what is not. All right. So, Mota. Yeah. Me can say something. Yeah, man. All right. So, basically, as it is, them reach a stage now where it's like the JLP party mm. want to go forward with the constitutional reform, as them say, because them say them do them town hall meetings and yeah. these things already. And so they're ready for move on. Um, as you say, it take consultation between both the JLP and the PNP. And the PNP on board with them and in agreement with them in terms of moving forward. Yeah, but the yeah. only sticking point, the big sticking point where them have right now is that the JLP want to maintain the court of appeal which is the high court of England, England yeah. while the PNP has said that we should have got towards the Caribbean court of appeal yeah. and so that are where them have them big difference right now but otherwise them all agreed in terms of moving forward and the having two of them have to yes, agree so are the two of them the two of them have to agree the two of them is the government yes the JLP can't come with something in our republic. Now, Muta, I'm not dispute you, you know, but I tell you, say, it's the same thing we're saying at all. Where they're they, they not agree seeing with the court, the, the high court, for the yeah. high court be. So it's stopped now. It gets stopped. So, so it gets stopped. That's what I'm telling you, the, 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 the leading government. They can't the start, come now and say they're not busy where you are, say. The, the leading government can't come say, I don't business where PNP you are, say. I have got through with it. No, they can't do that. Then I can't tell you. Yeah, I can't. But then I tell you, so it's, like it's a democracy. It's a democracy. So it's so a democracy. Yeah. So the two of them have to come to the conclusion. But the thing, so the two of them is the government. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. that's what I'm saying. The two of them is government. What yeah, can man. I so, say? What you know? Me, me, me want to ban bad word. And the other one said, no, me don't want to ban bad word. I'm going to come to. I can't do that. Yeah, but what I try to tell you, the PNP can't start nothing because they're the government. No, I don't talk about start or stop. Yeah, and the GLP have to start. It's two evils we are talking about. It's the two evils we are talking about, you know. Yeah. It's just the two evils, and now we are talking about constitution reform and them things there. One can get up one day and come say, where are right now? Look here, I forgot to do something about the road, them now, I have to dig them up. And then the other one said, no, me no, you know, dig them up, you know. And then the other one said, oh, I'm the ruling party. I'm going to tell you, say, I'm going to dig up. It don't work that way. No, especially this big thing we are going on, the Constitution. It don't work that way. That's why you see that in America, them have but, a Supreme Court. Supreme but like, uh, all right, like uh, the little law uh, where, where the ambushman, where, where, where them chop on the, the, the electoral. Uh, manager what they where them just voting and vote feet go on. Them little thing that them can go on you know, with them numbers, you know, with the, the amount of numbers that them have, you know. But the constitution no. No, you have things where the jail people because them have more people in the in the parliament there. They yeah. can't vote on something and the whole of them vote and they say a pure JLP, them win by two people and them win by four people. Yeah, so yeah. them do it. But uh, when we had come about changing the constitution, yeah, that different thing. Changing that different the kind thing. of government where we have, have a republican government. Yeah, that bigger thing. There's no me as the leader party, so therefore, no, no. So it work. It work with the two of them. The two of them are government. So you know, the two of them is government bridging. But when you look on what I go on, you know, like them are more slow, you know, like something. Yeah, well, obviously, them are more slow. That's why them have said, it can't come next year again. It can't come yeah. next year. That's what they have said. So, 
Anyway, we have to go move right now because we have a half hour ahead about half Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Bless, bless. All right. Yeah. Yes, this is a stepping razor. No, <laughs> I got that word. <laughs> My mouth I run fast and my brains. All right, this is a continent. We there we do. We know so we have one good all and all that. And yeah, no matter cost me, trust me. My girl child, no matter cost me, bro. Yeah, they do cost me a night child. Okay, my customer is going to play. So this me is going to play, no. my tonga. I'm a fan the, 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 the m- m- WhatsApp and get me on the radio. You know, understand that. I have a WhatsApp number, you know, I tell you all the while. I uh, never have a turn on the WhatsApp. I <laughs> never have a turn on the WhatsApp. We could play this. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to go and do it rather than. Uh, yeah, yeah. Greeting. Yeah, bless him. Yeah, greeting, Justify. I do. No, I'm perfect, love, but. Um, I'm on. Just one. Come in, the I on the, 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 the tape that I played early on. The, the Christian reason, but. Oh, both culture and the, the language. Literacy in particular, the yeah. yeah. language and the important yeah. language. Yeah, man, you can't. Yeah, man. So, so I want to give about some 25 years. I'm here more. I'm on, I'm on, I'll be a sweet poet, you know, one utterance I and I of any African language. But the first South African language I know, you're as Rasta, as youth. I, I, I'm a rich oh, man, yeah. like, like Peter Touch and him on there. The first one I hear was Swahili. Okay, well, well, Sata Matagana, Trippi, Pavy, Pavy, Wola, then, lot of them still, and... and, and no, well, I'm not talking about from music, you know. I'm not talking about from my black power days. Okay, okay, okay. We get okay, oriented right. into Swahili, okay. then we start Swahili. Well, 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 and, and the same vibration, you know? Mm. The, the thing where a man wants to say is, even, even Pan Africanist, you know, I and I, I'm an Arasta man, but I'm an Pan Africanist also, you know? Of course, they're not the Rasta, 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 not you can't be your centric because a brand of Christianity, especially when we practice in the United States, especially mm. at Jamaica, yeah, so. Yeah. A Greek or Roman mythology. Yeah. Even when they close their eyes, they're going to see a white image with, with, with the matter. Yeah. They're not going to say, you know, and, yeah. and, 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 and yes, yeah, Christus. So when you church your eyes, so when you church your eyes, you yes, it's Christus? No, I'm sorry. I'm not saying it's Christus. I want to see you be to my highly slapped street and I now get Okay. I not even be your day to some one time and I agree that we can't that should be a be on the bath water and fully over the day I come from. But uh, <laughs> stay focused. I'm on just a seat up with with the Xia V R Kitamar high yeah, 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 comfortable with that. But where I want to touch still the intellect among I and I as Rasta who can read and write properly. I, I think them are, them are, them are, them are, them are waste time and them don't know the importance of liberation literacy. 
because that, that have to do with the language. You know, they need to stop glorifying the language of the oppressor, which, which, which basically the English language only have a you know, go to school and, you know, you get, you know, you can't talk English school. You need to dash with that. All of that spell inferiority complex, my brother. You know I see? Mm. And if we know, if we know, if, if we know, if we know, if, if we can't trample upon that, all you have a bright and intelligent and all of that, you have a lose out by your spirituality. Mm. Every language functions on a different frequency. Mm. And, and the highest frequency right now is the Amaringa and the Keys. Because them things. Like, that are so, yeah, man, I thought she could be tight. Because, but normally, you know, when you, when you speak Amaric, Amaric and Keys, we use that together, even at Ethiopia, you know. Because uh, you what, know, what, you know, each, they don't know, each, uh, Ailey Silas, the word Ailey Silas is not American. You know. It is, it is these, all of the divine, every word we have to do with divinity. It, it, it's, it's these, because these is a pure language. It, it, there's no curse word in, in, in these, I know that. All right, so let me ask you a question now. Mm. Why you say American geese is the highest, um, where you call it? Where you call it a while ago? What do you mean when we call it that? Well, like, you know, you, you know what, um, frequency where you're talking about restaurants. No, that's women remember frequency, yeah. man, or restaurants, or baby, you said, no, man. Yeah, but the call of one, like, if, if they can't raise up and turn left, you know, 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 you just that, mentioned something a while ago. Mm. And you mentioned frequency. I truly don't remember the word frequency, yes, sir, when I deal with it. No, that means you don't listen to the teach. You can't even know what frequency No, I never say I don't know, I say I don't know what frequency means. I say I don't remember the word where you use. Who are all together within Iowa? No, but if you can't hold together, it's because you have an angle, man. No, man, I don't know that. You tell me, say, you tell me frequency, I truly don't remember the word. You are saying, I don't deal with it. I don't deal with nothing. I truly don't remember the word. Well, I think I'll give me a mix. Come like it. Yeah, no. You're the part of wrong frequency if you think that I'll give me a mix. All right. Well, we don't want to get competitive. All right. So let me ask you again. Yes. When you say American geese is the highest frequency, what do you mean by that? So Ethiopia the first. And, and, and that, especially these, 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 the, even, even the average Ethiopian on the street are Ethiopian. I don't know, don't know what these are. These is, 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 is like a liturgical language. Yeah, but I know that my heart's in origin. Uh, because I listen to speak. What is about the language that make it be the highest because frequency? At that, that, I listen to speak and I and I, have him in, you know, the eyes, eyes, all that. So, me you know, there is the agreement with that. But every one of the priests them speak American geese. Every one of them. Yes. So. But, yeah, but I answer your question as to why. No, you say, because I listen to speak it. Yeah. And, 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 and in, a, in a layman term, you know, a God language, you know, a bird language. In, in America, every, every, every sound that can be made, even by animals, mm. can be written in Amaringa. And I think that, there yeah, I know some of them, I think that I know these things. No, I don't are, know American, I don't know American. No, I'm not saying that you know American, but you know African, you're supposed to know the power. No, I don't know the power the way I talk about. That's well, what so, power. So, so when the, when the majesty, that you address that, they don't, they don't know, say, they don't know that. When my majesty, I chant, Yes, when his majesty speaks. Yeah, I know the word. I are Geneva and and and, and yeah, speaking, him translate them translating the word. Them I say. Yes, but even 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 before translation go on, the frequency. I don't know, understand when I'm talk America. I don't understand when I'm talk America. Well, 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 you you well, me have today against the of 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 as the as of of this from your talk still. Even well, though I'm not looking at it that way, because I'm not talking to that. But, 
there is one of the intellect among I and I. No, but I don't understand Amharic. I don't understand Amharic version. When I but you can talk, if you want to. Don't. Yeah, no, yeah, well, when I listen as a talk, Amharic, I don't understand what I'm saying. But, but yeah, man, we hear that, man. But what I'm saying to the eye, as a, as a, as a man who, who can speak English properly and even can read no, that I right. No, I can't English. talk English properly. Neither. No, man, I heard. Me, me hear you do that, man. I know your levels, man. So but you can't run for that. Okay. So when I said, okay, mm. I think it's imperative to all an intellects among I and I as Rasta. We see Ayala Slassi yeah. within certain light yeah. as even teacher. Yeah. You think so much yeah. learn Amharic? Some farm. If, 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 if it's even if it's even enough to say give thanks or let the word of fire and I mouth. I'll be too red at the medanite and yeah, I go and yell by said best day I'm a we just say, uh, let the words of fire and I mouth, yeah. and the invitation of fire and I heart be accepted in the sight of most I uh, see up here, get them out, highly slightly. If we can answer that, even yeah. if I'm on the middle of the fire and I heart, what happened? What happened when you said it? Down. When you said it, what happened? What happened when you said it? It's soothing, man. It's feeling. It, 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 the first thing it do, it, 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 it keep you in the know. So if they know if they know the power of no. If you can't see another no, to even Me not a big problem, really. Nine seconds. Me not a big eh? problem. Me not a big problem. What am to you? I have never yet sit down and say I want to study Amharic. Because the only place I hear Amharic talk is in Ethiopia. And when I go to the other African continent, you hear you already. I don't hear that language. You hear you that Swahili, but Swahili, Swahili, wait, no, Swahili is the biggest, is the most known common language in Africa. Most Africans will talk African language. Yeah, but it is not the, power, the, it's not the most powerful. But power in what way? What, what power are you searching for in the language? Within, 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 within a level, man, within, 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 within a frequency, within, 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 no. within a... Language is to is to make other people understand what you're saying. That's why you use language. Yes, but some so other you, are, other, other, you know, I have to want other people to understand where you are. You are I mean, Mr. So King himself. I spirit. I your mind. I don't use words. Right. So you know, yeah, even, you even, know, even, even if you utter the, the word of a president in your mind without the sound, you know. So, so, so there must be a language within that level. There, yeah, I see. Uh, talk okay. to me. No, no. So we have a region. So we have a. You see, we start to talk now. You have a good, that different attitude to where we are going. No, man. You have a reason. You have a free, free of man and reason. You know, All right. You want to know. You want to know. Hmm. Language, you mm -hmm. see, if you talk to somebody, mm -hmm. in order for them to understand you, you have to talk for them language. You see, if you go talk Amharic to mm -hmm. them on the road, them not going to understand where you are. No, you have to teach them. You have to teach no, them. You have to teach them. Teach why? You can't sit up on the corner. You just a pass a man and you hear the man, he might do something wrong, and you start talking Amharic to him. What, what are you teaching? You have to teach him. What are you teach him, say? You know, you know, you know, you can't go in the ghetto but sing with them youth there. Sit down with them youth there now. Mm -hmm. And you want them to deal with certain, for them home, for them family, school and everything. I start talking to talk to them in America. Not, not just like that, man. You have to prepare their mind. No, why you don't you talk that. to them in English? We talk our patwa, our Jamaican language. No, because you are no. You yeah. see, all I and I get comfortable with what with what with, with like where the data the, the data where you with the, with, 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 where I listen to where those play, play I said play. I yeah. said. Yeah, the the the, 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 the we need to, to to move away from 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 the oppressor language. Because we, by doing that we we, we, we stay oppressed. I almost stop feeling we, we get, that we get too comfortable in, in our oppression then, you know. The language. You know? 
Sorry, go ahead. So why you don't learn a language that, as an African, why you don't learn a language that most African will understand you if you go to Africa? Be able to say more on to that. Yeah. You know, my, my, my first, but me that, me you say, you know, so Ethiopia is your number one choice. No, but, no, 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 no. Ethiopia is my number one choice. Yeah, and no, 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 everybody have a choice. Everybody have a and, choice. Yeah, yeah, then they are everyone of free rasta. Yeah. But, but Ethiopia is my number one cho choice and are the only African country that I and I have ever tried. Most and rasta, them, most rasta I know say that. And when them go Ethiopia, mm. them don't stay there. No, sir, I'm comfortable with no, I'm not Ethiopia, you. man. No, are you right now, say? right now, we can't even chat the business for the, for the soul, but right now, I'm Ethiopia, I'm not saying. Yeah, I'm not, not saying Ethiopia to you, know, but it's not my first yes. choice in Sicklin. I'm not saying that I'm not saying that I'm not saying that. Most of the brethren, them who me know about Ethiopia, them, mm. every, them end up in either Ghana or South Africa. Because it depends on where I look for. Yeah, no, no, that, of course, it depends yeah, on where I look for. Material. Ethiopia is not. They have to be the materialistic mind, you know. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? you mean Ethiopia is not a materialistic mind? No, literally. Like a man who just want to get some money or want to get richer. Why you not? Know, why not? Ethiopia is very spiritual. Yeah. Ethiopia... Where is it spiritual, you mean? Where is it spiritual, you mean? Where is it spiritual, you mean? What is spiritual about Ethiopia as opposed to Nigeria, Ghana, Morocco, Senegal? What is the most spiritual about it? I can't compare them because I, I have only been to Ethiopia, but the comfort oh, of me... Oh, Ethiopia, you go, okay, okay, all right. The the, the, within them. myself, give me my efforts to see and certain, 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 even dream, <laughs> different, I yeah. mean, never dream them dream that yet. The Wobas? No, sir, I mean, no Wobas. Yeah, man, so, no, no, no. Yeah. It will be appealed to to a nice spirituality, so right? So you, 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 you have plan to go on next on next country, you just want to go back to Ethiopia? Me just want to go for Ethiopia. Yeah, you don't want, you right, don't want right, to go right, look for another part. You know? Right now we are communicating with some, with some priests up in, up in Arar, with, with the majesty band up in at yeah. El Jara. And you don't want to go another country in Africa? Of course. Because okay. to begin with, I don't really love Ethiopian man clothes. They're too tight. Me, 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 me like the room clothes. Me like what they are trying to be in. Because I'm a martial artist. I have to stretch and Ethiopia you know, clothes them too tight. You know? Yeah, but we're going to ask you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You plan for go to any other African country? You have yeah, planned but, but how do you go visit? Can you, we visit me at all? But I visit me at yes, all. Yes, man. But, but right like how you go so visit Ethiopia? Right now. Like how you go visit Ethiopia? You can't mm. go visit somewhere else, though. No, I don't want to do that. No right away. Right now, I make sure in connection in Ethiopia where I don't no have time to go run up and down and go to Africa. Please, yeah, go on. Okay. Go on, go up now. Rar, where yeah. we have work for them. All right. Yeah, see? Uh, we, 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 yeah, they, we have work. Yeah, they, they find a, 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 a ruins, a ancient church, and, and, and it, 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 it belongs to his Imperial Majesty, Madam. Mm. Yeah, I see. And what? Mm. And so where you going to do? Where you going to do? The wish, we refurbish it. Okay. My child kind of different, you know, Muta. My yeah, child kind of different. Way, it's it's sound away there. Yeah, let yeah, me tell you that. My, my child kind of different. different. Oh, my, my, my child is different. Let me tell you about me. I have, I have, I have, I have ship champion and a yacht. Not no around here, so I've been prepared. Okay. It's very tight, but good. Mm. Not no around here, which, yeah. Entice me right now. You see, I feel war and rumors of war, even though war. Why are they in Ethiopia? Why are they in Ethiopia? Yes, but, but why right now, if I should make my transition, I would, I would prefer to be there. All right, sir. And that's what I think there. Yeah. Yeah, I see? Yeah, me, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, yeah, now. Yeah. Right now, before, yeah. Before, just give me a minute before you see it up. Um, I'm on this one, and I encourage and I virgin and sister, especially, especially and I will walk within the footsteps of it. Of it, be able to touch the Amalek language. You, you know, the mm. the 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 
it, 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 and me, I encourage that, you know, Rasta, believe me, it brings you to a different level, higher. It's different, you, 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 it gives you, and what you do for your eyes, it's not going to do for the eyes, you know, because I don't know your eyes, no, love eyes. No, no, you want to break in. Yeah, I see. Me love eyes, I see. Mm. But, but, the language, you know, you know, God, we are no man, we are no fanatic, you know, this is what I have to know. We are no fanatic. We are no fanatic. We are no English word. And that you talk to me the whole night, that you talk to me. You are no fanatic. 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 Yeah. But you say, anytime I talk to people, I am not show them that I know I'm a rick if they don't understand me. I am not talk to them and make them understand what I say. Yeah, that's where I and most of the place where we go, mm -hmm. it's not America the matter. Right. It's just that. You don't, the get to, you, don't get to, you don't get to chase the language, man. That's the thing. Because you, 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 you yeah. go to Africa, but you, 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 you go all around. I don't so want just no language, you know. I don't want to communicate. When, 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 when Peter touched us, he said, Nigga, who's the guy? I'm with that, that Peter. Peter touched us, no, I'm married. I'm with that, no, Peter touched us, no, I'm married. Yes, you are. That is enough for the influence to come here, you to ride your bicycle. Then we don't care about Ireland's last year. I'm in the 60s. But we can't say Ireland's last year too. I'm in the 70s. Yes, but you can't say more than that. 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 You can't say even Debra when I say Abba Janai is yeah. the father. Yeah. They look at them look at thing there. You know, yeah. enough youth. Yeah, I'm gonna say I listen to say enough youth. I listen to say. I just I listen to say. Yes, man. If you don't know no other American language word, me know I listen to say. Just say. Uh, if, 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 if one day it comes to the eye and the eye no. eat up in herself. I listen to that. I see that. I myself and 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 choose to touch that. You have a full eye. That's it. Yeah, yeah. We have to go. 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 to go. We have 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 to go. Different program, totally different program, okay? So, to those of you who can just travel with me, travel with me. Go to your bed and wake up again. And, and I will have people who do it still. And we still have to tell you about the performance that going to take place on the 3rd of May. Skyline levels that are up at Jacks Hill. And would I like you come because I would have never seen me with my music yet, with my band. You understand? Would you people don't know how that works with the poetry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,